And the final race of day two will be a novice chase. Uh, two miles and one foot on the Devon Novices Chase. And the top one is the glider for Joshua Sutherland, the winner last week. Bueller for David Hooley. Guna Getaway, Graham Clitterbuck, Kinvara Windmill. And Martin Leadham, that was a winner last week. Rule the Seas, Paul Rhodes, Jordan in the Crown, Jim Murray. Coralie Ava, Dabravine for Thomas Rogers. Quithari Asin for Craig Allen, Rivo, Darren Thompson and Wood Spirit, Leon Van Rensburg. Away oh, they go in. And one or two... Interesting names in this one as they get to the first and they're all safely to the other side of it with Kinvara Windmill, the back marker, and it's Rule the Sea, which just in the lead from Guna Getaway as they go past the winning post. A circuit to go. And Rule the Seas for Paul Rhodes. It's clear. Wood Spirit in second for Leon Van Rensburg, then right on the far outside is Quithara Sin as they take the water, which they're all safely over, and towards the back Kinvara windmill is predominantly a hurdler. Over the third, I won over hurdles last week but couldn't get into a hurdles race this week, so that's a, take a chance in a chase race, might as well get a handicap mark while there's nothing else to do, and over that one they go, and rule the seas is the leader from Rivo, who's gone through into second, then Wood Spirit and Cora Livia Dabravine, then Beulah, that was a good horse this time, wasn't it, Beulah? And the gliders after that one, Wood Spirit, and Beulah again, always lost his place just a little bit, and Quithara Scene is towards the back there, and Kivara Winwell obviously doesn't like these big obstacles as much as he likes the hurdles, I think we're attacking them nicely last week. Going away, not going the same over the bigger obstacles. But Rule the Seas then goes up the hill in front. Oh, Bueller in second, Rivo in third, and probably even Dabravine and Jewel of the Crown and the Glider. And Wood Spirit going to get away. His next Quitharia scene, and finally Kimvara Windmill. With the fifth, they'll go. Getting okay, their way towards the midway point in the jumping. And over that one, Kinvara, we might really go that one a wallop at the back. And not looking all that keen as they get to number seven, where Ruler sees he's in the lead. But the glider is going nicely in second over that ditch. Oh, there's a fall, and their Bueller's gone, so that's a bit of a surprise. Bueller. Crashes out and Guna Getaway is now running on into third. As Cora Oliva de Bravine just hits a bit of a flat spot. Wood Spirit is not going well at all, and that one's been the retreat. So too is Rivo. They've only got four and a half furlongs to go, and Jordan the Crown's also at the back. So one or two of these you'd expect to be up there in the van are right at the back. So whether the pace is particularly tough or not, I don't know, but Rule of the Seas is well clear. Rule of the Seas is clear of the glider in second. Guna Getaway third. Then Corrigaliva Dabravine is after that one. And then Quithara Seen. But it's Rule of the Seas. He keeps going. He wins. And it's clear of the glider in second. The glider, though, is getting significantly closer as they take the third last. And the glider is just gliding into the lead. And the glider. Shows what he's called the glider as he comes to the second last, jumps over that one, gets away from it nicely. Jockey's not hard pressed at all, he's just pressed the button and said go. And this one has suddenly put the race totally to bed, then going to the final fence, pops over it. Guthara seems to run off from the back in second, but he's going to get anywhere near this leader. And the glider has taken that pretty cosily in the end, up towards the line. The glider takes it, Guthara seems to get back to Jordan the Crown third, then going to get away and all the season of Corio and the Breen. And Wood Spirit was last, and I would say but that shows that that race was ran at too strong a pace because they set it up for the closers, really. The glider and then Quithara Scene and Jordan the Crown are right out of the back most of the time. So the glider takes it for Joshua Sutherland, Quithara Scene, Craig Allen second, Jordan the Crown for Jim Murray was third, Guna Getaway for Grand Clitter was fourth, and Rule of Seas for Paul Rhodes was fifth. That's your lot for day two, and we'll be back for day three tomorrow. <laughs>